Hi everyone, it's Jonathan Allen here from Camp RV in Stratford, Ontario. Got a special treat for you today. It's our very first Flagstaff E-Pro. It's a 2019 E-Pro 17 PR. Just arrived from the factory. It's our first 2019 that we've got on the lot. And this one's got a really nice floor plan to it. It's a half hybrid with a Murphy bed at the front. Nice and light, it only weighs 3,100 pounds. Uh, and I'm gonna give you a nice walk around tour and we'll show you the inside today. Uh, so first of all, they do use a molded fiberglass cap on the front. You can see it's got the LED marker lights up in the front corner. Diamond plating down below. It's also got an LED light on the front. It's got the power front tongue jack. And with that, so up and down, touch of a button. And then there's a built-in light on it as well. This one's also got the jacket uh, bike hitch, which goes right on the front. And with that, it'll hold two bikes for you. It's got the dual propane tanks with the easy access tab, two 20 pound tanks which do come filled. And then this one's set up for two batteries, so you got the two battery boxes in behind. It's got the four corner stabilizer jacks, so there is one on each corner that cranks down. It's also set up with the power awning, and the power awning has built in LED lights. And it does have the springs built into the awning so you can have one side lower than the other to let water trickle off. Storage compartment right at the front. Nice little compartment that you can put all your blocks of wood in, pieces for the, uh, the bike rack, also the bag for the power cord is kept in there. It's got the frameless windows, and then as you can see it's equipped with the Wi-Fi Ranger, which is a Wi-Fi extender. So if you're camped at a campground where you don't have uh, Wi-Fi access that's very close, that'll extend the range for you. It's got the keyless entry on the door, Large entry assist handle that'll fold over the door during transit. It's got outdoor power outlet, outdoor speaker, and then with this one, it does have the Coleman camp grill with the tabletop that it sits on. And that just slides right off and then you can store that inside underneath the bed. Propane hookup is right underneath. It's got the aluminum wheels. As I mentioned, it's a half hybrid model. So you do get the hybrid bed end on the far side. LED tail lights. It's also got the pre-wiring for the backup camera. And then it's got the LED marker lights up at the top. We'll make our way around to the other side as well. Got another storage compartment on the off door side. Extra room for cranks and anything else you want to bring with you. Like I mentioned, the frameless windows, so nice big frameless window on this side. All the hookups are over here, so the freshwater holding tank. We've got the fridge vents, the water heater. Back here, we've got the black tank flusher. We've also got the outside shower, which is hot and cold tap with a shower head that pulls out. Cable and satellite hookups, sewer hookup down below, and then the city water connection is back here. 30 amp power connection with the status indicator, so with that, it lights up blue when you've got power. But we're gonna make our way inside here and I'll show you the interior. This one is set up with the new set of stairs. So you'll notice that there is no set of stairs down below. They're right in the door frame and then they fold right down. There's just a pin that locks it into place. All made of aluminum so they're nice and light. And then it does have the separating screen door so friction hinge on the main door, which will hold that door into place. Then you can separate your screen door and just have the screen. So then it reconnects right back to the main door. Making our way inside. This one's got the Murphy bed at the front. So as you can see, it's got the sofa and there's a bed that folds down over top. Now Les is gonna give us a hand here because there is the table that'll set up in, in front of the sofa. A lot easier to have an assistant rather than trying to do this with one hand. So this would be your eating area. So you can sit at the sofa, nice big table. But then to put it into a bed, we just fold the table right back up. And then the nice spot to store the table just beside the sofa there. And then being a Murphy bed, so you do have the storage underneath the bed. 
but then that just jackknifes down. And then there's a latch on each side that gets unlocked, and then it just pulls right down. So then we've got the Murphy bed. So they got the straps that just hold all your pillows and blankets in place, as well as the mattress. And then there is a latch here to unlock it. So when you want to unlock it to put it back up, you just pull that out. It lifts right up. It folds right back into place. You can see there's a latch on either side to lock it into place. The sofa then just jackknifes right back up. And then you got your sitting area. Thanks, Les. Now also you do have the wardrobe cabinet on either side of the bed here. Spot for hanging your clothes. It's also got the little bedside tables with power outlets. The other side's got the charge center, so you got USB and 12 volt plugs. You can see the windows have the pull down shades on them. And with those, you just pull them down and let them go and they'll slide right up. Roof vent up above the bed with the built-in max air fan. All the interior lights are LED. It's also got the speakers built into the ceiling for the stereo, as well as the outdoor speakers. Control panel is down here, so your lights, the power on and control, and then the water heater, as well as the water pump. Everything's centrally located right here. So the kitchen area, you get lots of nice storage, nice big pantry. And then the fridge, which is propane and electric, has the freezer built in as well. And then you got the stainless steel sink, drawer storage down below. All the drawers are on ball bearings, so they slide nice and easy. It's got a really nice look to it. You can see it's got that kind of off offset two-tone white color for the cabinets. It's got the wall-mounted TV, and that is on a pull-out bracket. So you can pull that and spin it towards your sofa and your bed. But then it just folds right back towards the wall. Stereo is right beside, so the stereo is AM, FM, and Bluetooth, and then the TV actually has a built-in DVD player on it, right on the side there. I know it's kind of tough to see with the glare we got going on. And then you've got the three burner stove with the flush mount glass stove cover. That folds right up, gives you access to the three burners. Looks like the top's popped off. And then you've got access to the three burners, then this just folds right back over top. So when you're not using the stove, you got all this extra counter space. There's a built-in microwave down below. And then up above the stove, you do have the light and the fan built right in. You can see these do come wired for solar. Right at the back here, you've got your half hybrid bed, so it's a heated mattress. Actually, the cord for that was sitting in the fridge. I'm not sure if you noticed that when I opened the fridge. But then, the nice thing about this is you don't actually have to have this bed open. So if you don't need this bed, you don't have to open it. Everything's still accessible. It's just when you need to use the bed for extra sleeping that you open it up. So this is great for somebody that uh, uh, only has the occasional visitor and is pulling with a nice uh, light vehicle. Uh, grandparents, when their grandkids are coming here and there, really ideal layout for these ones. Uh, also has the light and fan built right into the hybrid end and then storage up above that see a nice big storage cabinet here as well the box for the tv is in there right now but you got the hanger up above to hang your clothes nice deep cabinets here as well bathroom is fully enclosed so it's got the foot flush toilet got the vanity with storage and then there is a medicine cabinet Roof vent above with the built-in Max Air fan. And then the tub shower combo with the skylight up above. It's got the nice floor. It's a tile look linoleum. So it's all one piece, very easy to clean. AC is roof mounted. And then the furnace is vented through the sidewall cabinets. So again, this is the 2019 Flagstaff E-Pro 17PR. So we now have this model in stock at Camp RV in Stratford. 
Now, my name is Jonathan Allen. Thanks for watching our video. Come on in anytime, and we'd love to show you through this great new floor plan. Uh, we always have the E-Pros in stock. We have quite a few of them on order. A bunch of different floor plans coming in that are going to be available. You can check out our, all of our available inventory on our website, which is campoutrv.com. Or stop in and see us at any time. So thanks again for watching our video, and have a great day.